Good morning, today is the 3rd of September. September. Monday. Monday, the 3rd of September. Yeah, and uh, now we're starting on a good day today because we are going to the stadium and see the Nomad Games Cock Bower. We hope we can get into the stadium. Yeah, we hope we can <laughs> go into the stadium today because yesterday there was a lot of uh, policemen, a big boss in a black, a black jacket and he was just shouting and shouting and shouting. <laughs> so that, that yesterday it was a funny day in the evening. So yeah. yeah and even now, though we didn't see any games. Yeah, <laughs> now we have been on this good restaurant and we have eaten nice. breakfast and now we are going to the No Bad Games and we hope we will come in there because today we very hope to see it. and what is we are seeing today? Cockboro. Cockboro. <laughs> and this is the restaurant. Okay. This is how far we got yesterday. We got here and couldn't go any further. Now it looks like we can go further today. There's still a lot of whistling going on though, but never mind. Let's see how far we can get to them. When we were at Song Kun, where we didn't have no internet for quite a few days, uh, we met a couple from uh, Germany, I think it was. Uh, and they were so kind to when they left Song Kun um, before us and went down to the hotel, they were so kind to send an email to my mom to let her know that we were so okay, but we just didn't have no internet. Um, and now it's very funny now here uh, at the Nomad Games. We just happened to meet them again here, just walking over to the games. Mm -hmm. So that was quite funny. Yeah, we'll say thank you to them. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, let's see if we can go inside. So this is the place we saw on the TV yesterday. Today we can get in, completely free. Okay, what we're going to see here is something called Cock Boru. This is the game I told you about yesterday where they play with the headless goat. And they have to get the... Uh, the headless goat has to go in the, the kind of goals, I would imagine. This is a round green thing there. Should start at 11 o'clock. You better see the first game of cock ballroom, it's kind of polo with horses. Look at the game we're watching here, this is Kyrgyzstan and Mongolia. So they just started, if you see the goat, it's just there. Here they race to get the goat. And he has to pick it up. Who's going to pick it up? Now they have to race to... Uh, so this is a sport that needs a lot of strength just to pick up the goat. The goat, the goat weighs 30 kilos. Just to pick that up on the floor and uh, carry it on a horse there. It needs a lot of strength. It looks like Kyrgyzstan have won by a long, long way. Kyrgyzstan have 29 points and Mongolia have 5. So, uh, quite a big victory to Kyrgyzstan. Okay, new game is starting.
this is the team of Afghanistan. This is the national sport in Afghanistan. So this is what they're best at. Okay, this game we're watching here. This is Afghanistan and Russia. We're actually a team from Moscow in Russia. Okay, these two teams, the Afghanistan and Russia, they play really hard. They don't take no messing about. <laughs> Okay, the coach is there in the middle. Which team gets there first? Basically, have to just pick the goat up. Carry. Moscow has the goat now. Okay, can he get it in? Yeah. Okay, it looks like Moscow are doing quite well against the Afghanistan here. Let's see what happens. So Afghanistan just caught the first goal. himself <laughs> and his horse ran away I'm not too sure whether the horse is like this kind of thing they seem to run away whenever they get the chance okay it's the way we go again who is going to get there first pretty simple game really pick up the goat throw it in the goal that's all you have to do really so that's like Moscow have won. 7-2. So even though it's Afghanistan's national sport, they didn't do too well here. Mm -hmm. Russia have the lead today. They're winning, yeah. Now there are uh, music, very high music, because Russia have won. Team and I just have a picture with him. Yes. <laughs> Pretty cool. Okay, so behind me, this is the Sport and Recreation Centre. This is where we're coming tomorrow. We'll see some wrestling and other kinds of things here. So, uh, we've just seen Kokboro today, and uh, tomorrow we'll be here again. So, new sport tomorrow. Okay, and over here is arm wrestling, believe it or not. <laughs> we'll be coming to see this tomorrow as well, looks like fun. The local fruit market not far from our hotel here. Some nice things. Okay, Meadow and Jamie are going paragliding. Where are you going, Jamie? Good. Where are you going? Uh, up in the sky with the paraglider. So yeah, um, ten minutes or um, ten or five minutes we will be on the sky on a paraglider, wow. not like a parachute. over there okay boat is in position the rope is taut Okay, they're flying! <laughs> Okay, 
andere Landing. Is that good? Yeah, very good. Very high over the water. What was it like? It was just nice. Actually, very high over the water. Yeah. Feel <laughs> like you can feel your skin and your is it copper? Your body? Your body in the sky. <laughs> and feel the wind and there are lots of wind up there. Yeah. It's good. Did you feel like a bird? Yeah. Nice. Oh, yeah. Very, good. very good. I think you've tried that. Yeah. Thank you.